Okay, greetings everyone. Welcome to Gerard Black in the Philippines with the truth. I'm going to welcome my subscribers, all my supporters, all my commenters, you know, all of you, all my scallywags, all my uh, 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 haters, all of you. I'm going to welcome you to my channel. Well, right now I'm in Dumaguete and this is a special, this place holds a special place in my heart because this used to be Bogarts. This was the first establishment that I that I came to when I came to do with Bill McGetty. So the fact that it's still here and operating, it's under a different owner, and I'm gonna introduce you to the owner now. Right now, I'll introduce you to David. How you doing, David? Yeah, I'm fine. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, tell me where you're from. Yeah, uh, okay. Tell me, tell me where you're from. I'm uh, from the UK, uh, living in uh, Kati and uh, Dumaguete now. And uh, we've been in this bar for two months and uh, it's going well. Nice place, nice people, uh, and the business is good. Okay, so you are from Australia? I'm from the UK. Oh, you My can. business partner is from Australia. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, is this your first bar uh, venture? or First in the yes. Okay, okay, so you own a couple of other establishments that we're involved in this type of business. Yeah, I'm in the castle. Okay, so how long have you been in the Philippines all together? Five years, but living full time, just over a year. So I'm in Okay, okay. So what is it, what is it that, that you like? I've only been there like five years myself. You know, uh, what is it that draws you to the Philippines? What is it you like about the Philippines? Well, the weather, friendly people, uh, lots of interesting places. Uh, it's the first time I had someone who did not say, and the girls. <laughs> I got to say, go ahead. you totally legit. Okay, so uh, what advice would you give someone about following their dreams and their goals? Uh, I think everything is possible. Things, uh, just be positive. Uh, be careful, but be positive. Okay, so let's talk about the menu, the, the cuisine here. Yeah. What, what, what type of food do you serve here? All sorts of food, uh, all sorts of things from different countries, but the chef is very well known in the area. Okay. She has a good reputation, she's worked here for a long time. Okay, and what's her name? Because uh, okay. Her name's Jonah, okay. and it's Jonah's Kitchen. And uh, yeah, she has a good reputation. She's worked in other bars in the area, Okay. Is there a Facebook page, website, somewhere to go to see? It's something that we're working on because we haven't established the name yet. Okay. And uh, what is the name now? What? What? It, it doesn't have one. It is Bogart, Game on Sports Bar, uh, Boulevard Sports Bar. Okay. There is a Boulevard Sports Bar web uh, Facebook page. Um, but we're, yeah, we're still not decided. Probably Bogart is going to get the well, you know, yeah. get the, the, the dog, well, we don't know. Gerard's place doesn't sound too bad. <laughs> <laughs> Dave, yeah. thanks a lot for the interview, man. Appreciate yeah. it. We're going to take a look around, okay? Yeah, no problem. Okay, thank me on the camera. Okay, you me and look around the place. Come on in. Hello, everybody. Hello, Hello, Hello. 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 Oh, yeah. about Bogard. Uh, he was the owner of Bogard and he was the first person who I met when I came to the beginning looking for a place. And Andy has been real tight. Him and his family, uh, he's allowed me to do a number of events here and it's just been special. So, so how you been, man? So, so what are you doing these days? Andy's no stranger to my rock. <laughs> so what are you doing these days? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, we're gonna pause this right here because of the music. Okay, so uh, the wife and kids and the family is all right. Are you planning on opening up another place or you had it? I should. Yeah, you should. I like, but we should not get to go in here. Okay. Okay. If I do something, then it Okay, well, we're sure we're sure. don't forget me. Okay? Who's 
just something new, just something nice. Erica. Hello, Dai, how are you? What is your name? I learned to be for a Swiss 
guy. Oh, okay. He's a very good chef and I will come with him a Swiss cook. And some of that I just... Yeah. What, what's your favorite, your favorite nationality food to eat? American, Swiss, Italian, what? What's your, what's your I like to eat uh, any kind of food. As long as you're cooking, right? <laughs> 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 Alright, so I'm going to eat the rice. Rice? Yeah, rice. 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 What advice would you give someone about following their dreams? Because you had a dream of always being a cook, a chef, and here you are a chef. So what advice would you give someone about following their dreams and their goals? Follow their uh, ambition and how to become. Okay. Yeah. Okay, is there a website or somewhere like this where they can find you? Yeah. Facebook? Okay, I have, so. I have Facebook. I have Jonas Kitchen. That's the one right there. Uh, you can see my uh, menu. That's, uh, that's uh, also my website. Okay, yeah. My okay, good. Okay, yeah, right, right here. I'll hold it up yeah. here to see it. Uh, I will copy this and put this in the video. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, okay, so the website, you have anything on here? No, I just only that's our Facebook. Okay, okay. Jonah, it's an absolute pleasure to meet you. Got a good, strong handshake. I'm looking forward to sink my teeth in those bricks, okay? Okay, that's no okay. 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 okay, thank you guys. And we'll be right back. Wanna thank me on the camera. Okay, uh, so Jonah just prepared me my favorite meal. Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. Wow, three ribs, Jonah. Was this made with love? And don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, share, and like. I had to finish that off for the girls because, like I always say, thank you for my haters. Because there was one drunk idiot who kept jumping in front of the of the the video shoot and uh, would not stop it. So, but God is good. He gave me that little segment in there to put in without his crazy ass jumping through it. Okay, so remember, you're watching Gerard Black in the Philippines with the truth. Dreams are nothing more than plans awaiting action. Never disrespect the elderly. Always pull someone up. And sometimes, sometimes you may be the only one to see your vision. And the best revenge in life is to live good. I'm living good today. I hope you are too. And if you're lucky enough to have a woman like Ollie Woodson, former lead singer of The Temptation, once sung, treat her like a lady. And ladies, if you're lucky enough to have a good man like, like me, never say no. And treat him like a king. And that means standing behind him. I'll talk to you later. I'll always love you more. May you live to be 100 and me 100 minus a day.
So I'll never know that good people like you have ever gone away. That's from Frankie Crocker, WBLS FM. I'll always love you more. Love you like a love song, baby. I'll talk to you later. Peace. In fact, this is a shot of Frankie Crocker and Dennis Edwards of The Temptations. Peace. And enjoy these few shots from yesterday's activities. <laughs>